Welcome back, folks, one and all, to Let's Play Hordes of the Underdark. And when we last left off, we had just completely and utterly mincemeated this man. We mincemeated him because we had to. Not because we... Wow, that, that corpse was alive before I unpaused. I killed him. I killed him with the pause button. Deacon, I'm a monster! Uh, technically, boss, I is monster! You missed the point as usual. So, let us continue. We need to go to the eastern area first. Oh, there was something in there. Thank you. An unidentified dagger, wine, and lots of miscellaneous guff. And a thunderstone. And a malachite. What is this? Deacon? Identify it for me, Deacon. An ice talon. Is it in this? Oh, wow, my inventory is just full of stuff. Not a very good weapon. Probably be selling it. And that fire will burn forever. Because that is what fire... Why do they have a noose down here? Alastair is into some very, very strange things. There is one other person we haven't encountered of the original group, and that would be the veritable cleric. And the veritable cleric is probably in the eastern area. The eastern area which we are about to go to. We have numerous pieces of chain which are probably used to open the doors down to level 3. However, we were also told that there is a ability to create a portal to free some slaves. And it is the... Uh, there is a track here. Yes? Is there something you... You got in the way of my ability to look at the track, Sharwin humanoid tracks, which says, Hey, one of the former companions went this way. Fortunately, it's not the companion we want, because I have the companions I want right now. And I'm not going to say that I have the companions I need, either. Because we don't have a lot of beef in this team yet. I'm the only one that can actually hit people. So, we really need some strong melee hitters, and Deacon has the ability to just hang around, but... Oh. This is surprisingly empty. I don't like this. I really don't like this. So, let's open the door. What is behind door number... Ooh. Human tigers garbed in the clothes of nobility, Rakshasa used their considerable powers to maintain their decadent lifestyles as others' expense. Oh, bust your gun! I think that is. Oh, hello. There's two of them. Oh God, there's four. Of them. Careful! These outsiders can be. There is no escape. Um. I anticipated these guys being tougher than they are. Okay, okay they hurt. Careful! These outsiders can be tricky! Yeah, hit them! Careful! Not me. These outsiders can be tricky! Thanks for telling me, Inseric. I'll be sure to remember that. He's a firstborn. Apparently, he's a lot tougher. Well, the Adepts didn't last very long, did he? Can you, can you die, please? 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 Can we? Attack? Get on him! Attack! Thank you, Deacon. Murder! Is he armed with a sickle? You think he actually got. Oh. I think he has, um. His enemy. I think it's time for me to heal myself. By the way, I'm going to heal. All that damage you did, completely negated. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Ow. This guy's... Oh, one critical hit. That's all we needed. That's all we needed. Do you have anything on you? Yes. Armor. We already know it's a sickle plus three. Dig it? Hmm. And that's a mirror shield and a kumakawa. 
What does the mirror shield do? If I could guess, it has spell resistance. And this armor provides improved evasion. Well, that's, um... Well, that's a dead, filthy slave. As opposed to a dead, non-filthy slave. There can't be any enemies in the next room if we can heal. But I'm not going to trust this game as far as I can fling it, and considering it's a digital uh, download. I can fling it a long way. I do have the CD over there, but... I'd rather run it in, um... I'd rather run it in a much more compatible manner. So! Rakshasa! Proved it. I hope those are statues and not people that have been turned to stone and set on fire. Sorry. Um, nope. Me can't do that. Oh, fine. Give it up! You ain't got a chance! Oh. <sighs> this weapon does nothing. Oh. How? Ah, oh, 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 oh. hang on, hang yes? on, hang on, hang on, hang on. That... We have an item. I can do stuff. Can't I open that? With that? Sorry. Um, nope. Me can't do that. Hmm. Don't we have a key? Now this is curious. I'm sure we did. I'm sure we picked up keys. Hmm. And I can't use... Sorry. Um, nope. Me can't do that. Hmm. Sorry. Um, nope. Me can't do that. Why not? I should be able to open this door. I can't bash it down either. Hmm. Hmm. There's nothing left in the remains. Oh. There's also a key. Wah, wah. Yep. There's a key as well. Let's use the key. Ooh, is this a nymph's cloak plus five? It is, and it looks spiffy. And it's very good for a sorcerer. Or a bard. Aha. What's this? Common folk here inside Undermountain? How very strange. This old man approaches you timidly, with his head bowed and his eyes cast down in a subservient manner. The, the Rakshas are in the other room are dead. Did, did you kill them? I, I, are you here to save us? The Rakshas are dead, but who are you? My name is Sharish, leader of these people, or at least as much a leader as any. You see... Everyone here is a slave. A poor soul bound and forced to serve the mad wizard Alasta. You we slaves? That's very sad. Deacon not believes in slavery. Unless Master wants slaves to sing and dance and tell stories. That's what old Master do with Deacon. That'd be okay, I guess. Sadly, our duties are far removed from singing and dancing. Alasta prefers other, more, more deadly diversions. He enjoys watching adventurers die. And that's why I created Under Mountain. Sharwin shakes her head sadly. I can understand a wizard having supernatural servants, but why would Halaster even need human slaves? The Rakshas are outside were supposed to protect us from the other creatures here in Under Mountain, and make sure we never tried to escape. Not that we could have tried in any case. Halaster's magic bound us to this place. But now Halaster has disappeared, and the spells binding us here have faded. So now that I've killed the Rakshasa, you're free to leave? I wish it were that easy, my lord. But there are many terrible creatures roaming the halls of Undermountain, to say nothing of all the trow who recently appeared. Um, I kind of killed all of them. You can't have possibly killed every single creature you encountered in Undermountain. Well, there were a few rats, but they seemed pretty timid. I still don't believe you. It would be suicide for us to venture out of these chambers. 
few of us might escape these halls, but most would never make it to the surface alive. But there might be another way for us to escape this place. There is a magic portal in this section of the dungeon. A back door, if you will. I last built it as an emergency escape route. The portal can only be used by someone who possesses the proper activation stone. Without it, the portal is useless. False hope to tempt and torture us. But if we could get that stone... May I have the activation stone right here? You have it? Quickly, give... Oh, there's a Rakshasa. Oh, wait, sorry. Give it to me so we can escape this problem once and for all. Oh, wait, no, it's the Jin. The Jinny bottle at your side begins to shake and rumble. Suddenly, the stopper pops free and a billow of dark smoke rushes forth. Forgive the intrusion, but I don't think you want to give the activation stone to these... What are you pretending to be this time, Sharish? This is none of your concern, you semi-sentient puff of wind. Get back in your bottle where you belong. I never liked you very much, Sharish. I'll go. But first, I think this mortal needs to see your true form. You will pay for this, Vulcarian. After I feast on this human's fool's flesh, I will bind you to my service for a thousand years. Cortano, I'd be more worried about what this mortal is going to do to you, Sharish. I'll be inside my bottle if anyone else needs me. Oh! You're a Rakshasa. And you're not a very challenging one. Careful! These outsiders can be tricky! In fact, most of you are outsiders. Most of you are Rakshasas too. Handy. Careful! Oh, what the earth is that? I'll tell you what that is. Careful. That was the nasty. A solid blow. Thank you. Thank you very much. That was a flame arrow, if ever I saw one. That was a magic missile. These outsiders can be tricky. Let's kill! Shereesh probably has a very nice weapon on that his possession. There is no wrong. Are you going to tell me that Rakshas are great? Yeah, you can't win. Eventually I will critical hit you. Yep, I will critical hit you to death. Is there another one? No, I think we, uh... Well, there is one. But first, I will take all of this. Is that a rogue stone on him? Yes. Stop raining ice on me, I'm trying to loot. <laughs> ah! You killed my dog! It's very rude. <laughs> well, now you are dead. That'll make you think twice about killing my summoned wolf. Well, we won! But there are still enemies nearby. Hmm. But perhaps not here. Any more things I can loot? There is a pile of stuff here that I can grab. I think the Rakshasa were looking to escape this place. To be fair, <laughs> I can't really blame them. They are, after all, extremely nasty. Now imagine if you managed to do this, though, without getting the gin bottle. You would have freed, I don't know, six, like five or six Rakshasa into the middle of Neverwinter. Because that portal does take them to Neverwinter. <laughs> now imagine... Imagine that. Just think about it. And I will leave you with that thought, while I save and call it a video. And when we come back, we'll explore the rest of this area and move down to floor 3. I'll catch you later. See you then. Later.